what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new and you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash i hope that you guys are doing well i truly do comment down below how you're doing today and what your scent of the day is i'm going to be telling you guys all about what i'm wearing today what i've been using what i've been loving i really want to talk to you guys about how to completely get rid of body odor this is kind of going to be like a part three video to the one that i made a long time ago a couple months ago uh the reason why i wanted to do that i've been getting a lot of comments on that video in particular as of late and i wanted to just do an update because there's some more products that i have found out about that it almost feels like I'm gatekeeping because I haven't been able to sit down and make this video. But now I'm here and I'm going to share them with you. I know how many people that video helped and it really was like incredible to me. So that's what this video was about. So if you want to know how to get rid of body odor, you want to smell your best all the time. If you're like a sweaty person like me, um, this video is going to be super helpful for you. So I have a vlog coming soon. So for those of you who love the Shop With Me vlogs, that is coming. That should be the next video after this. I've been buying a whole bunch of things, but I want to talk to you guys about the warmer months coming up okay it's about to be spring okay it's winter i don't know it's been kind of like sticking around a little bit longer than it should be if i'm honest but spring and summer is coming along which means it's going to be a little bit hotter you're going to be out there probably going to sweat a little bit more so you're going to want to stay fresh all day so i have a product for you that i've been using i want to talk about my shower routine i want to talk about the things i've been using on my body my skincare my body care that all of that on a regular day, my shower routine is really, really simple. I love to do shower routines here on my channel, but it's really simple most of the times. I don't always go in-depth. I probably do like an in-depth routine with like a body scrub, exfoliators, all type of things. Probably like twice a week, honestly, because normal people, we have normal lives, we have work, we tire, want to go to sleep. It's just like that. But to ensure that I'm smelling fresh all the time, there's a staple in my shower that I'm always using, and that is my Dr. Bronner's Baby Unscented Soap. I've been using this soap forever. This one's literally empty. I have one downstairs that's actually bigger that I've been using. This is a great soap, especially if you have sensitive skin, especially if you're going to want to use something that is just called a base clean. A base clean is something that I talk about here on my channel all the time because I'm a fragrance lover. I like scented soaps. That's just what I'm able to use. I don't have sensitive skin, but if you do, I do recommend this Dr. Bronner's Baby Unscented Soap. I use it everywhere, everywhere, okay? When I tell you guys, when it comes to my shower, I do shower twice a day. If I work out, I'm probably gonna shower again. It just depends. I don't like to be sweaty. I don't sleep comfortably if I'm like not showered. I have to wake up in the morning. It's kind of like my wake up routine. I have to take a shower. So the Dr. Bronner's Baby Unscented Soap, you can get this in Walmart, you can get this in Target. Uh, you can pretty much get this almost anywhere. I get these, this little baby one I got in Marshalls. You can find these in Marshalls for a lot lower um, of a price, so highly recommend this. I recommend if you have armpit odor, you have any type of body odor, use this first as your base clean. Scrub your underarms with this. Um, you want to get off any deodorant, any type of residue that's left on the underarms. You can tell, like, depending on the deodorant that you use, you want to make sure that it's getting off. You don't want that to stick onto your body and get in. No. So this is what I use every single day doesn't matter i'm getting in the shower i'm using my dr bronner's baby and scented soap now when it comes to body wash and soaps like that i feel like when i use my bath and body work soap that's kind of like a treat for me i don't always like to go in with those my main body wash right now let me tell you it has been this this is my second bottle of this this is the gentle wash hypoallergenic oat milk and comforting vanilla i don't know how long this is going to be available in walmart i have only seen it in walmart i've only seen it in walmart and i've ordered three of them because it's that good i don't order things you know in bulk unless it's good because why would i do that um but i use this i love this this is actually so crazy because it is soft soap this is only about 3.97 in walmart um not expensive but let me tell you when i get out the shower i still smell this on my body when i tell you it's like one of those scents where you're like oh i smell fresh and someone else knows i smell fresh and they're gonna ask me what soap i'm wearing or what soap i use in the shower this is it i love this because it does give me a nice clean i feel really clean after using it it's a very nice scent it's very refreshing and again a lot of body washes don't linger outside of the shower and this definitely does i've been obsessed with this i use it every day it's such a pretty scent this is one of my favorite scents from Soft Soap. I'm hoping Soft Soap will keep this in the stores um, and never take it out. But that's just what happens. They get things and then, you know, they go away. But I do recommend this one. This does smell so, so, so good. Now, if you have drier skin, okay, this is going to be one of your best bets, okay? This is the Dove Body Love Moisture Boost. I love this. When I tell you Olay Body Wash, this is kind of like 
uh, I'm I don't want to say runner up. I feel like it's passing Olay for me. I really like Olay body wash because it does uh, moisturize the skin and this is giving, okay? This smells good. It feels good. When I found out about this, I just was using it nonstop. I was talking about it nonstop here on my channel. It smells so good and the feeling is amazing. This is one of my favorite body washes as of right now. It's a body cleanser. It has hyaluronic serum and moringa oil. It, it kind of is supposed to moisturize your skin for about 24 hours. If you do have dry or dehydrated skin, recommend this for you. However, I don't have dry skin. I just really like it. I like feeling like this. I like something that's like a lotion in the shower. After I use like a base clean soap, I would go in with this. Now here's a treat though. So they actually came out with this Moisture Boost Pre-Cleanse Shower Butter. My, um, I almost said something else. <laughs> I actually went ahead and used this as a body butter by accident. Please do not do that. This is actually just a uh, in shower moisturizer where you're gonna wash it off. I didn't know that I thought this was a body butter little did I know um, And I was wondering why it wasn't rubbing in right, but I still went to bed and I was uncomfortable But yeah, so when you get in the shower first thing you're gonna go ahead and use this This has like it's the same scent, but it's just more so you're really gonna get that moisture So you're gonna get the moisture boost body butter here that you're gonna wash off in the shower It's a pre cleanser then you're gonna go in with this cleanser and your shower routine is gonna be elite another one that I'm so happy to tell you guys about way actually sent this over to me and they released their body cleansers if you love the melrose place scent and if you don't know about the melrose place scent this is kind of like a nice floral rosy kind of scent i'm actually going to get into them a little bit more later on in the video but way has body cleansers and i do recommend them i do love this they have another cleanser that isn't as scented as like the melrose place or like the uh, North Bondi scent, but this is it. I was really excited to get this so I had to share that with you Okay, so I talked to you guys a little bit about the body wash that I use every single day um, And I want to show you guys this so I talked about this in the first video that I made and that video will be down below So you guys can watch it But panoxyl has also been proven to really help with body odor and a lot of people of course use this for acne You can use this as a face wash, but you can also use it on your underarms And if you want to try it out, you can pick it up at Walmart um, I have tried it personally. I feel like it has helped me um, But panoxyl if you guys didn't know really helps with underarm odor um, And you can use this almost every day as like a base clean wash if you want to really get off the um, Deodorant under your arms and um, yeah, so this is really good And if you do have acne if you are struggling and that's why today I didn't even wear makeup you guys I decided to like not put on any makeup. I have a little bit of powder on my face But I didn't wear any makeup because I have been breaking out really bad so I was like you know what maybe it's the makeup I've been wearing makeup pretty much like every day so I was like let's just give it a break okay so now we're gonna get into some of the more fancy things in my shower so this is actually new I'm gonna be talking about this on my vlog channel well <laughs> on my vlog channel in my next vlog I do have a vlog channel though at the ash life um, I do like um, body cleansers that have like a perfume to it um, this is like for my like date nights or if I'm going out I'm really stepping out I want to smell fresh I want to feel good but I do like those like if you ever want to try out a body cleanser that has like a perfume in it you should especially if you Want to smell your absolute best and you want to pair it with a body lotion a body cream and a perfume afterwards um this is the mark jacobs perfect love this i got this in tj maxx for about 24 dollars um and it was um or maybe it was 19 dollars I don't know <laughs> but it is a perfume body wash those are really nice you should implement those into your shower routine if you don't have sensitive skin but yeah it really adds a little extra something it gives you a nice fragrance and what I like about this is that again I mentioned this earlier a lot of body wash um, doesn't last out the shower like you get that nice smell in the shower but when it comes to getting out you smell like water you know you smell regular <laughs> but when you use something like this it's gonna linger even outside of the shower especially after you pair it with a body cream and I'm going to show you guys some things like that that I recommend and that I use daily. Now here's a treat for you. This is the Skin Fix Glycolic Renewing Scrub. This is a pre-shower and in-shower exfoliator. So you can use this all over, okay? So you're going to really get that skin to be glowing afterwards. You're going to get all that gunk out. And I use this. So you basically use this before you turn on the shower. You dry rub the cream in. It works as a chemical peel and it helps loosen dead skin cells. And what's good about this, you can actually use this about three times a week. I really was introduced to this by Leah's face here on YouTube. I love her channel. I believe she was using 
using this in one of her videos and I was like, oh my gosh, I ran and got it and I've been loving it and I've had it ever since. I got this one, I believe it was at Sephora. So this is really good if you want a full body exfoliator, um, especially under the arms as well. If you made it this far in the video, give a thumbs up and if it's been helpful to you, let me know in the comments down below. But let's talk about some things that I've been using as far as deodorant because deodorant is essential. You need deodorant, I need deodorant, I just, Especially if you are a sweaty person, you're gonna need some deodorant, okay? So a couple months ago, a brand reached out to me and they are called Sweat Block. And I saw them on TikTok and I, you know, I didn't really pay much attention, but when they reached out to me and gave me a chance to try their products and this is not sponsored, um, I fell in love. Now, what I love about Sweat Block is that it literally blocks the sweat in terms of literally blocking any type of odor that's gonna come out. You're gonna literally smell fresh all day. This one right here is the Dry Boost Antiperspirant Wipe. You can use this on your underarms, anywhere there's a little crease that sweats, okay? You can put this there and it's gonna help you. I promise you it will help you because it's helped me so very much. I know a lot of you like Lumi and I've tried Lumi and it's been okay for me but it wasn't like the best. But I have to say, this right here is so amazing. I will link this down below. Please try it out, especially if you are a sweaty person and you are afraid of having any type of body odor. This is going to help. You literally almost don't even need a deodorant with this. Like you literally just put it on your armpit like this. Wherever you have a crease and a crevice that sweats we get sweat in a lot of places so you know what I'm saying um, this is the dry boost antiperspirant wipe um, you can apply it at night to clean and dry underarms let me clarify though you're not actually gonna rub it you're gonna like dab it like this under your arms so it's not really to rub and then actually you just let it air dry and you put it on before bed this is it okay and also they have the face ones so if you are going to go to the gym you want to put this on your forehead and just to help with the sweating um this is really good i have oily skin so this really helps because um i need oil control and this has it um i really like that because it helps with the you know shiny face type vibe when i wear makeup you know my the oil just is deciding to like hello hi it just wants to greet everyone um and this really helps with that so it comes in little um wipes like this and you can just go ahead and put it on your face <laughs> so this is the face wipe versus the um this is the antiperspirant wipe for your body and this one you actually would wait like 30 minutes between using like a lotion on your face or some sort of moisturizer but again these are best to be applied and nighttime like i'm telling you if i recommend anything from this video uh it's the sweat block odor protection this has been literally god sent for me um they also have deodorants as well this is in the scent coastal fresh so i've been using these as well love them um the scent is really fresh it almost smells like a man to me, but it's it's unisex. It's perfect for me. I love that. I've been I even used men's deodorant before. I've tried almost every deodorant in the book, so trust me, I know what works and what doesn't, especially for my body. So they do have this one. Again, the scent is really nice. And when it comes to deodorant, I switch it up all the time. A deodorant that I really love and I want to share with you guys, and I don't know where it is right now, but I have it and it's somewhere. I've been doing renovations in my house, so things are all over the place. But it's the Donna Karen New York deodorant. Okay, I'm gonna put the picture right here if anything has ever worked for me when it comes to body odor if it comes to sweating if it comes to anything like that smelling fresh all day it's the donna karen deodorant this deodorant was literally like i was shook when it actually worked and my armpits were smelling so good <laughs> and i mean it it was just I, and so many people have told me like since i recommended it to them they purchased it and it, it was so helpful to them so i do want to mention it again in this video i will link it down below um the donna karen deodorant is again one of my number one deodorants ever it really really works it works and secret came out with these new this is the ph balanced shower fresh deodorant um this one i feel like it works but it doesn't work forever though i feel like it just is it's okay um but i did want to show you guys this just in case you are looking for like a ph balanced deodorant and a deodorant that has been working for me i've been using this this is probably my everyday deodorant at this point this is the degree 72 hour motion sensed uh shower clean advanced deodorant this works if anything works for me it's this uh it's just amazing degree really be killing it with the deodorants okay i have to tell you this one really works if you are looking for something that's gonna stop sweating like i'm in my room and it's pretty hot and there's really no 
no sweat <laughs> it's hot in here like there's no fan on there's no ac on in my house and if i wasn't wearing deodorant i'd probably be sweating a lot right now and i have anxiety as well so when i do feel anxious or nervous about anything uh the sweat will literally just force itself out of my body so i really try to you know make sure i put on my deodorant every day and the degree is really really helpful and i really like this one this is probably my top two deodorant now these two are new i'm still sampling them out at night i do like to apply aluminum free deodorants and i've been using the caudalie um this is the deodorant stick this is a natural stick deodorant it smells like eucalyptus it smells really nice i put this on right out of the shower smelling super fresh and clean i got this at sephora and you guys can try this one out this is more so i recommend for nighttime use i like caudalie products so i did purchases the sales rep at sephora actually recommended this to me so i picked it up and i feel like this is more of a protector for nighttime where i'm not sweating that much but i still want to smell super fresh and last on the deodorant thing i just have to say so a lot of people uh, recommended this necessary deodorant gel to me i do want to say to you guys to try it this is something i want you to try to see if it works for you but as someone who actually sweats more than usual i feel like this may not be the best option only because it is a wet liquid gel deodorant so it's gonna come on already wet when there's wetness under my armpits it kind of makes my armpits want to be wet i guess um and it does i don't think this was the best option for me because i went to sephora literally for this and i don't feel like i'm in love with this deodorant but a lot of people have said that this works for them um for me personally i don't really think so but i do want to show it to you just in case you want to try it and this could actually be something that's going to change your life or be helpful to you so i, I don't want to gatekeep that information i want to give it to you and it also smells like eucalyptus now let's quickly talk about exfoliating i like i said i usually only exfoliate about two times a week depending on how i feel and in my last video i mentioned um one of the things that i love to use this is my tree hut turmeric scrub turmeric is really good it also helps to lighten the underarms as well if you do struggle with dark underarms it also helps with that and you can create your own turmeric scrub right at home I've just had this for a long time and I love tree head scrubs. You don't have to use a physical exfoliant under your armpits, but I do. I personally don't mind it. It has been helpful to me, especially when I want to get off that extra deodorant and things like that. If you want a liquid exfoliant, you can use this on your face. So many people love this and I see so many people have this in their collection, so I'm really happy. This is the Ordinary Glycolic Acid Toner. This is a toner. You can also use it as a exfoliator under your underarms and a lot of people are actually using it as a deodorant and it has been proven to help a lot of people for that me personally i feel like mm, it didn't work as a deodorant actually but it does help with exfoliating and getting that area really nice clean and renewed so these are the two things that i pretty much use to exfoliate my underarms um and really get that nice feel back there okay so <laughs> The turmeric scrub, turmeric is really, really good. Look up the benefits of turmeric. And this is actually really hard to find. That's why I didn't really want to show it, but it is what I've been using. Um, I don't know why Tree Hut released this and um, never released it again, but it is a good one. It is a really, really good one. And this, you can find it in stores now. Um, and there's a lot of videos on the internet here about this specific toner. So I put you on to it so you can do the rest of the research and just look that up um, and let me know what you think. A lot of people don't know about tanned skin. Uh, if you're going to shave your underarms, again, I shave my underarms very frequently. So I want to go ahead and put this under there. This really helps with ingrown hairs, razor bumps, and um, with shaving and waxing. I struggle with razor bumps and things like that. So I always make sure to put on my tanned skin afterwards. You can use this in your bikini line area. You can use it under arms your face whatever wherever you're going to be waxing and shaving at to prevent ingrown hairs and all those bumps and things that just make life not so fun okay so 10 skin try it out lastly i want to talk about this skin i want to talk about body care that's a big thing on my channel that's a big thing in my life my skin's always moisturized it's always gonna be soft i'm always gonna be feeling my skin if you can feel me in person you're gonna tell me my skin is soft it's one of my favorite compliments i love to moisturize my skin i love to put on body creams and i'm gonna show you guys some body creams that i've been using a lot of people actually forget to moisturize the underarms it's because i know we put deodorant there but deodorant can be very drying one thing that i really love to put under my arms is the raw shea nourish body balm from palmers um i use this all over my body i've been looking for this and i had finally found it and i was so in love with it it smells really nice i love when people tell me i smell like cocoa butter and like 
that's one of my favorite compliments so i use the raw shade nourish body balm um and also with your deodorants guys here's a tip a lot of people don't know it's good to clean off your deodorant so if you just have your deodorant and you take like an you know an antibacterial wipe and just clean off the top it really helps to get off any types of like germs or bacteria that can actually linger on the deodorant stick so here it is i use this all over my body and i do always remember to moisturize my armpits since last year when this was released this is the best body cream ever this is the fenty skin body butter this is the butter drop it's actually like a cream to oil type body butter, so it's really, really good. I love Fenty Skin. This is my favorite product from Fenty Skin, and I really recommend this all over the body just to make sure that you're moisturized. And if you aren't looking for something that's too heavily scented, uh, I would highly recommend you get this because it has a nice floral note to it, but it's very, very subtle. So you're going to smell nice, and it's going to sit close to the skin, and you're going to be very moisturized along with that. I talked to you guys about whey earlier. I'm even wearing the whey body cream today. I love whey. I use whey all the time. Oh, thank you, whey, for sending this new one over to me. This is my older one. They have a new one here. They sent me a brand new one. Love the Melrose Place. I actually had to order this like online um, somewhere else because they weren't selling this at Sephora. So now I have a new Melrose Place body cream obsessed i love whey products whey is perfect for a nice fresh body cream out the shower at night or in the daytime pairing your body cream with a perfume is amazing it's gonna make you smell like that girl you're gonna be smelling that good all day okay so i love my laura mercier ombre Vini body cream this is one of those body creams that i've said over and over i have a dedicated video to this on my channel you can go ahead and check that out this is a body cream you're not even gonna need a perfume with it's that good a thing about perfumed body creams is that they don't actually moisturize the skin very well but with this i do feel that my skin is very moisturized that was the one thing that i said was like a plus about this is that it lingers all day smells really good projects well and of course moisturizes my skin now quickly showing you just a few combos again a perfumed body cream right here and then i would go ahead and pair my carolina herrera good girl now my good girl's actually up there but this is the very good girl in the red bottle i know she's sexy she's seductive we know um and then i go in with this this is one of the bangers so i don't always take it out all the time but oh, when i'm gonna smell good all night baby this is what i'm gonna do and it's just incredible so if you didn't know about these type of body creams now you know a new pickup for me is my coco noir this is from chanel love the bottle it goes perfectly back here that's why i love it and of course the scent is just gorgeous i love chanel fragrances if you want something that's going to be heavy hitter long lasting i always say go for chanel but i always want to use this this is a body cream this actually came with it well <laughs> it's a it pairs with it it didn't come with it i had to purchase it separately but it's perfect especially if you want your fragrance to last all day this is what i recommend you do you get the lotion and then you get the perfume pair those together baby everybody's gonna be complimenting you and this is one of my favorites so highly recommend just a few more this is my new chanel paris riviera she's beautiful this is a very like sit close to the skin but nicely scented feminine perfume it's just gorgeous uh, and it has a very light mister oh this is just like every girl's dream um it's beautiful and i had to just share this one with you because it's so pretty now two more perfumes that i have this is my scent of the day make sure if you haven't yet drop your scent of the day in the comments down below so that i can you know find out about some new stuff i tell you guys all the time let me know what you see educate me too because this is what the channel is here for we're all here to educate each other share things with each other it's just a getaway from life because life is crazy okay so this is the one that i love when the rain stops from replica just gorgeous listen i'm gonna smell like a thousand things but fragrance is my happiness it's my happy place so um i do recommend this perfume delina from perfumes de marley love this i really wanted to bring this out and show you guys because delina has a body cream and the body cream is just as good as a perfume when i wear the body cream people think i have a perfume on and i literally don't so if you wear this and the body cream you're gonna be set you're gonna be smelling good all day delina this is the baby bottle it's so cute but i decided this would be the best bet for me because i don't go through my perfumes that fast and of course if you're on a budget this is probably about a hundred dollars and then you can get the bigger one for like three four hundred dollars which is very very pricey so you can start off with this pair it with the body cream you're set 
And that is it for this video. I had so many things I wanted to share with you guys. New things, older things. I just wanted to reiterate a lot of things and of course throw in the new stuff too. If you are struggling, this is a safe place for you. Let me know in the comments down below what you are using. Share any tips that you guys have in the comments. That's what it is for. I'm excited for you guys to see this video. I'm excited for your feedback and I'm excited to post more content. If you're looking forward to vlogs, I have those coming up very, very soon. Um, it's just like you don't gotta film the vlog. It's like a couple days, you know, of footage. So I'm gonna edit this video now. Get it up for you guys and i will see you guys in the next video don't forget to follow me on instagram at ash220 underscore and tiktok at living ash 20 and subscribe to the channel we're trying to get to 100k this year so i'm very very excited about that i love you guys and i'll see you in the next one bye guys